Hello. Now, it is time for I am truly sorry for the news delay. I am truly sorry. I'll cut that moment of silence later on. Now, the news today is a heat wave, a heat wave in the western U.S. Oh, that's the weather. Screw that. Zimmerman. The Zimmerman trial. I usually report to you once a week. But the Zimmerman trial was because they had a shop. Did you know that? They had a shop? Um, well, one person thought he was being assaulted with Fist, which is Zimmerman, and was the one being assaulted. And he responded by with a punch with a gun. Now apparently that seems very <laughs> that seems very reasonable. Someone someone hits me, I hit them back with a gun. How will you do it in Russia? But no. No. Wait, this that's a little too dramatic. Alright? Well, they didn't even hit you, and then you over-dramatized by shooting them. I think the person has a very good case, the defendant has a very good case against Zim Zimmerman here for an overreaction. I wouldn't have just stuck with the fist fight, but eh, I digress. Well, Man was caught beating, eating women. Well, a black male was caught beating a female mother for jewels, and he. I don't know what his name was. I forgot, but he beat a woman right in front of their daughter. If I was the one that was there, I would have just got my knife and everything. But however, he's a three-year-old, and I'm with Yusef, so that's the different thing going on here. Um, so let's check that off. That's the introduction, people. And I would like to say... Oh, crap. Wait, YouTube now. Man caught a beating a female on nanny here. I'm watching it now. Sorry, advertisements.
Good morning, Lori and Michelle. And the video is graphic, but it is crystal clear. It actually came from the woman's own nanny camp. Yes, it is graphic, but man, crystal both clear. Over police he is still on the loose after attacking a woman in her home. Now, the man punches the woman repeatedly and kicks her all in front of her three-year-old sitting on the couch. He tries choking her at one I'm sorry, graphic, but very clear. Don't that, don't that, doesn't that mean the same thing? Point for eventually tossing her down the stairs. Now, one and a half year old napping upstairs, he took off with jewelry, including her wedding ring. Now, let's take a look at this neighborhood. I just want to show you, this is your typical tree-lined street, sidewalks. Everyone has a well-maintained yard. Lots of families in this neighborhood. Yes, well-maintained yard has a lot so of shows on really But let's screw that. Um... So that is what happened on that day. It was very sad. I was very sad to hear that news. <laughs> um, and also, hmm, what else happened? So, oh, the Kim Kardashian. I had a child. Can somebody give her a bravo? No. No, no, no. She, sa she said she never will do this again. Ah, poor guy, whoever is her husband. that she'll ne never get pregnant again. But however, with the Kardashians, it's a little hard to... possible stomach infection or appendicitis before she gave birth at the weekend. again because she has a stomach infection but apparently if they take out the appendix then the, she might be able to unfortunately she's a little too dramatic like usual I don't know how they got famous they got famous because they're a model and well right now she looks like she's modeling pain but next Right, and YouTube, what's new? <laughs> Vatican Bank investigation snares Bishop. Italian police uh, arrested a senior or Vatican Bank official and the two other men Friday. Hey, <laughs> was it on the 13th? Friday the 13th, you know how it is. On the suspicion of financial fraud connected with the Vatican's Institute of Religious Works. So, so, bank, wait, they snare Bishop. Bishop was probably caught, was probably caught stealing from the bank and it became a religious work. Huh? It's funny how moral the world is today. And we are basically supporting the... Ooh, 
Vampire Diaries actress charged in Ryson Letters case. Yes, yes, yes. A Texas actress has been indicted on the three federal ch threat charges for allegedly sending rice and lice letters to President Obama, New York, York City Mayor Michael Bloomberg, and Mark Blaze, head of the gun control organization. The indictment, made public Friday, charges 35-year-old Shannon Guess Richardson of New Boston, New Boston, Texas, with the threat of the press that threatening the President of the United States and two charges of mailing and threatening letters. If convicted, Richardson can be sentenced to five years in prison for each charge. Oh, looks like we finally lose that dumb show, Vampire Diaries. Finally! We finally lose them. We wouldn't have to listen to Vampire Diaries anymore. Um, Richardson, a former Dallas beauty queen who has had minor roles, pulls in TV series including The Vampire Diaries, Walking Dead, and All My Children. Well, she really is a Walking Dead. Imagine she's just, she's just sending letters like. I better really. I, I can't wait till the future, like, so it's not a poisonous letter, it's a poisonous text. Can you imagine that? And then we'll, like, literally be zombies. She said. You will have to kill me and my family before you get my guns. Anyone wants to come to my house will get shot in the face. That wasn't threatening. That was self-defense, of course. Um, they never were taking... No, screw it. Well, you know how it is. These girls that are on Vampire Diaries are a little insane. Of course, and she has access to all the poison. Johnny Delk and a... An attorney for Richardson's husband, Nathan Richardson, said Richardson sent the letter in attempt to set up her husband who was seeking divorce. She contacted federal investigators claiming she had found a suspicious substance in the refrigerator and raised and related internet searches on a couple's computer. Probably hers! <laughs> she, she's just playing innocent. No! That that ricin letter was mine. Oh no no no! Somebody somebody was using my computer to have ricin. Get that, not me. Screw this. Um, YouTube. I hope you enjoyed the news today. And remember, the more knowledge, the better it is for the world. President Barack Obama is getting a little shot down by Republicans here. Still on that hooker thing. Anyway, bye bye. Good day.